Hello guys, so welcome back to my channel. It's me again, Teacher Yang. So last time we studied about the addition of integers, right? So for today's video, we're going to study about the subtraction of integers. So without further ado, let's keep on watching, keep on learning. So rule natin, change the sign of the subtrahend and proceed to addition. Okay, so proceed to addition, copy. Proceed to addition, so minus, from minus, magiging plus. So, 8 plus, so let's change the sign of the subtrahend, plus negative 2. Okay, that's it. So, 8 plus negative 2, so dito natin i-apply yung rules ng addition of integers. So, 8 plus negative 2 equals positive 6. Okay, copy the sign of the subtrahend of the bigger number. Okay, next. 10 minus negative 5. So, proceed to addition. 10 plus positive 5. Okay, so 10 plus positive 5 equals positive 15. That's it. Next. Negative 15 minus 6. So, negative 15 minus, or uh, I should say plus, negative 6. So, magiging negative 6. Negative 6. That's it. So, negative 15 plus negative 6 equals negative what? Negative what? Negative 21. That's it. Next, negative 9 minus negative 9. So, copy plus, change the sign of the subtrahend, positive 9. Okay. So, negative 9, negative 9 plus positive 9, automatically it's 0. Kasi, di ba ang rules natin? Negative plus positive, automatically magsusubtract ka kapag negative and positive ang symbol ng numbers, okay? So, ganun lang siya. So, subtraction, proceed to addition, change the sign of the subtrahend. Ayan, subtrahend. Okay? So, ito, itong nasa unahan, yung minuend natin, hindi natin babaguhin yung symbols niya. So, ito lang ang babaguhin natin ang symbols and itong mga to, itong minus sign, gagawin natin addition and yung second numbers or yung subtrahend natin, gagawin natin, papalitan natin ng symbols. Okay? Okay guys, so para maging klaro ang ating explanation, sabay-sabay natin sagutan itong apat na to. Okay? So, always remember the rules. Proceed to addition, change the sign of the subtrahend and proceed to addition. Okay? So, negative 6 minus... 30 equals negative 6 plus negative 30. Okay. So, negative 6 plus negative 30 equals negative 36. Okay. So, negative plus negative, negative. Neg then, positive 2 minus negative 2. So, positive 2. Hindi natin babaguhin yung minuend. Plus positive 2 okay so 2 plus 2 equals 4 that's it positive 4 next ne negative 24 minus negative 22 copy negative 24 plus positive 22 okay so, negative and positive bullet. Negative 24 plus positive 20, 22 equals negative 2. That's it. Kasi negative, negative plus positive tayo. So, pag negative and positive, sabi ko, magsusubtract tayo. Okay? Next, always apply the rules of addition of integers. Next, 5 minus 19. So, copy. 5 plus negative 19. Okay. 
5 plus negative 19 equals what? Negative, kasi positive to, negative to, so the answer is negative 14. That's it. Ganun lang siya kadali. So, always remember the four rules of addition of integers. A-apply natin, magagamit din natin siya sa subtraction of integers para mas maging madali sa inyo, okay? So guys, that's all about subtraction of integers. So before we end this video, remind ko lang sa inyo na yung pinag-aralan natin na 4 rules of addition of integers last time, gagamit natin yun sa subtraction of integers. So yung mga hindi pa nakakuha dyan, yung, yung mga hindi pa gets. So balik-balikan lang natin yung videos, yung addition and subtraction. Panoorin natin ng panoorin hanggang sa ma-master natin. So guys, kapag na-master nyo na yan, I'm sure maning-mani na lang sa inyo yan, okay? So, for the next videos, yung multiplication and addition of integers na lang tayo. So, for sure, mas madali ang multiplication and, addition, and division of integers kaysa sa addition and subtraction. So, pag-aralan natin ng pag-aralan lahat ng rules and I'm pretty sure, maning-maning sa inyo lahat yan. So, that's all for today's video. See you on my next lesson.